Today we're coming to you from our new science lab because Liam and I are going to be talking to you about... The Air Walker! The Air Walker, a very cool robot from Thames and Cosmos. The Air Walker does five different things. There are five different models, but the one we're interested in right now is the fact that it can walk up walls, right Liam? Yep. So what do you think? Are you looking forward to doing this? Yeah, I have for a while. Yeah, so we're going to build this today. Uh, this particular uh, piece uh, makes five different sets. The air walker itself, a simple walker, a suction lifter, a sideways walker, and a crawler. But today, we're going to look at the air walker, right? Yep. All right, Liam, let's dump this out, see what's inside, shall we? Mm -hmm. Okay, come on. Ooh. Ooh, very cool stuff. All right, so there's the instructions. Here are the different pieces. All right, let's see what's in this little box here, shall we? Mm -hmm. What do we got? Ooh. Pop. Oh, very cool. Suction cup. Suction cup. And suction cup. Okay, so here are all the pieces. Just to let everybody know, the Air Walker is going to include uh, need two AA batteries, they're not included. Uh, we just always have a drawer of batteries at this point. So these are the instructions, uh -huh. but they're actually a comic. Oh, cool. This is very cool looking. So we have a character here. He's got red hair like you. Oh. And he's got like funky goggles on as well, like you've got on right now. <laughs> Ricky, turn faces. What else does this look like? Looks like the instructions go on as you go. Yeah, very cool. Oh, cool. And will the legs go in there? Mm hmm All right, what do the legs look like? Oh, all right. And what's that on the end? Suction cup. Oh, that's how it's going to climb. Mm hmm And is there a headpiece as well? Mm hmm Very cool. All right. We're all done here. So, Liam, here is Nexo the Air Walker. It didn't take you very long to make this, did it? Yeah, it didn't. Um, so, why don't you tell us what Nexo does? How does this work? So, there's a switch here, uh -huh. and the legs move back and forth. Okay. And as that happens, the head turns. So, what do those tubes do? They create a negative air pressure. So, negative air pressure. That's how this works. The suction cups go up and down, and what these tubes do is they remove the air from the suction cup, which flattens it out, causing it to stick to a smooth surface, right? Yep. Another example of negative air pressure would be when you, like, suck out all the air in a wa from a water bottle. And what happens to that water bottle when you do that? It, it gets crushed. It gets crushed because you're removing the air from inside, so the air pressure outside crushes in. That's something that we learned today. Now, don't worry too much about learning the technical abilities of uh, how the robot works, because that's all in this great instruction booklet right here, which again is set up like a comic book. It has a full explanation of how the robot works, so you can learn while you're having fun. Whoa! That's cool, right? Okay, so as you see, the hoses lift and reapply the suction cup, and it is actually able to climb the window. What do you know? In these days of online learning, of course, it's really important to make sure that your kids have activities that help boost their education. So the trick to that is to make education fun. So you can build yourself a little robotics lab at home. Liam, you've been into robotics for a couple years now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we were even in summer camp uh, last year, you did some robotics. Mm -hmm. And uh, he's uh, an experienced robotics master now. And your child can be too. So get yourself an Airwalker. Nexo the Airwalker from Thames and Cosmos. See you later. Bye.